Thank you for visiting my channel. This is the Queen Phoenix. This beautiful stitch in front of me. This pattern is called Primrose. It's made up of single crochets, double crochets and chain stitches and half a double crochets. Very easy to make. Completely reversible, meaning it's the same on one side as it is the other. Let's get right into it. You will need some yarn and a hook. In order to make this pattern, you will need to have a multiple of three stitches. And you need to add two more chain to that. So I'm go I've made 15 chain and two more, a total of 17. I'm going to work in the back humps of my work. The very first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to work one single crochet in the third chain from my hook. So it's one, two, three, and I'm going to make one single crochet in the third chain from my hook. Then I'm going to make two chain and one single crochet in the same chain. So in the third chain, I have one single crochet, two chain, and one single crochet. I'm going to skip two chain, one, two, and I'm going to repeat one single crochet, two chain, one single crochet. You will continue to skip two chain in the third chain, one single crochet, two chain, one single crochet. Again, skip two chain, one single crochet, two chain, and one single crochet in the same chain. And you will do this, and I will meet you at the end. When you get to your last two chain, you'll skip one chain, and in the very last chain, you're going to work one half a double crochet. This is row one. Chain three. This chain three counts as your first double crochet. Turn your walk for round two. For this row, you're only going to work in the chain two spaces of your previous row. The chain two spaces that you have in between your single crochets, that's where you're going to work. You're going to work three double crochets into the third, into the chain two space. So let's make three double crochets into your two chain space. And you're going to do that in the next chain two space also. Three double crochets. And you will continue that to the end. When you get to the end, you're going to work one double crochet into the chain two of the previous row. Chain one and turn your work. Work one half a double crochet in the first stitch. This is row number three. Now we've made these three, the three double crochets. So I'm going to call them a little, a cluster. You're going to skip the first double crochet and you're going to work into the middle of your, of, you're going to work in the center double crochet of each and every three double crochet clusters. You only work in the middle double crochet, please. Into this, you're going to work one single crochet, so skip the first double crochet, the one in the center, one single crochet, two chain, 
one single crochet. Again, sk skip the double crochet, the next double crochet, the one in the center of the three, one single crochet, two chain, one single crochet. And you will repeat this until you get to the end. So it's one single crochet, two chain, one single crochet in the middle, in the center double crochet of each three chain cluster. This is now, I'm nearly um, at the end again. In your very last stitch, so you're going to skip the, skip the double crochet in the very last one. You make one half a double crochet. That's it. You will repeat row two and row three until you get to your desired length. Thank you so much for watching this. When you try this, please tag me in the video. Don't forget to, to subscribe to my channel. Much more videos to come. Share, like, comment, all of the above. This is the Queen Phoenix out.